Number five. It's just had a new car. There was nothing wrong with the old one. You should see that garden. It's an absolute disgrace. That is a massive extension they're having built. Do you really need it? The friends just bought this house. It's um, bigger than ours. Really pleased for them. Oh my goodness. I feel like bringing my children here and saying if they don't concentrate at homeschooling, this is the sort of house they're going to live in when they're older. <sighs> the houses around here aren't as nice as mine. You know, I work really hard at school and uni to provide for my family. <sighs> Makes you think. Who needs a house that big? It's immoral. You know, if I work a little bit harder, I reckon we could afford all the houses around here. How do people afford to live around here? Must be old money or something. Hedge fund manager? Doubt they're contributing to society. <laughs> Two Teslas in the drive. Two. Is that even green? What on earth made them choose those window frames? They must have cost an absolute fortune. Totally not in keeping with the house. I would rather die than live in that place. Literally. I do not get how they can afford that. They've either got a rich uncle who's died, or they're up to their necks in debt. You should see some of the cars who park in this church car park. Church I go to. One of the biggest Anglican churches in the area. Rectory, where the boss lives. Massive Georgian house, massive. It's not his though. He has to get out of it when he leaves a job. It's not his. 